Well, hello there. Today I'm gonna tell you about a case study in what I like to call scalable product-based side hustles. And if you've been around the channel for a while, you might know that I'm a fan of side hustles like SaaS, software as a service, e-commerce and info products. Um, just because they they scale well you don't have to spend a lot of your time uh, actually doing work in those um, side hustles and so what that does is it allows you like to do other things for example if you are running another business uh, launching an e-commerce or in an info product or a SaaS doesn't mean you have to multiply your workload by twice as much so there, there's a lot of advantages there. And if you are working a day job, it also means that uh, you can keep your day job, keep your main um, day, day job income, and you won't actually be um, affected in your productivity. Because if you're not working hard on your day job, you might get fired, which happens if you're pursuing a side hustle that basically requires you to like, spend a lot of uh you know time uh fulfilling some other work of of the actual uh you know of your actual job so let's say for example you were to go in and do something like doordash or some other side hustles that require a lot of time right like you're being paid by the hour or by the delivery then that might affect your your day job because for example if you're having to leave uh before work is done just so you can go fulfill something that begins to cut into your day income so i really like the um scalable what i call scalable product based side hustles and it's one of the it's one of the business models um, that i'm gonna be uh, just showing you guys how to actually get off the ground and you can watch my videos that go into uh, some of these business models so um, there's uh, a guy out there called uh, daniel fazio and i've been following him online and i think he's built like if you're interested in SaaS as a side hustle you can really copy his funnel or learn from his funnel so let me just break down for you how you actually build a phenomenal funnel for software as a service. So the space that he's involved in is code email. Okay, code email is very useful for agencies and businesses like that that wanna reach um, kinda like a B2B audience. And so how, do, how does Daniel Fazio actually um, create clients for his software as a service? This is where his funnel really comes into play. And this is basically how you did it. So he's got like three levels of product. The very first level of product that he has is, um, I forget the exact name of it, but it's basically a bunch of code email swipe files. Uh, so what this basically does is when people get into his ecosystem, they can buy these swipes. So it, it, it's like a bunch of templates that already um, can communicate the value of, you know, whatever these guys are trying to sell. So you can basically just buy the templates, plug them into your code email system and start sending emails to land clients. And it's like a low ticket product. It's like, I don't know, maybe 20 bucks or 50 bucks, however much it is. Uh, but it's a low commitment thing, which means a lot of people will be able to buy that. That's level one. And then level two for like more serious people, those more serious people that want even more value from Daniel Fazio uh, can jump in and buy, he has a full course, right? So they go in, they buy the course and the course is like, I think it's, I, I have no idea. It might be like 500 bucks to 1,500 bucks, but um, it's not unusual, right, to have a higher ticket cost, like 2,000 bucks, 3,000 bucks, uh, especially in that space of like code email. You might, you might buy some really high end ninja type stuff. So for those more serious people, they then have this mid tier thing, the course to buy. So see how he progressed from a very low ticket swipe file of code email templates 
to now they're buying a course that's giving them a lot more guidance, a lot more value. And then at the third level, this is actually where the SaaS comes into play. So here is a software as a service called List Kit. And what it does is it basically gives you a bunch of leads. Like if you're an agency or something like that, um, it basically gives you a bunch of leads so that you can send emails to them and you can buy as many leads as you want. Um, but look at what his ecosystem for SaaS actually does. is It actually creates a situation where it takes somebody in code who basically has a little bit of interest in um, code email and gives him like a bunch of templates, code email templates for like 20 bucks or 50 bucks. And then it progresses him. Over time, he's upsold to this course, which is like 500 bucks, 1,500 bucks, somewhere in that uh, kind of pricing uh, tier. And then over time, uh, from the course, he's gonna learn a lot of really useful ninja stuff. And then he's gonna say like, I'm seeing a lot of success now, I need even more leads. And then now that's where the software as a service comes in, like, okay, yeah, you can get all the leads you want every month for this subscription, or you buy a lead for this amount of money. Now, if you are a really successful code emailer, you need a lot of leads. So all these products along the way that made you more successful with code email actually prepared you really well to be like an ideal customer for the SaaS. Uh, and I think it's a genius strategy. And uh, Daniel Faye, your, uh, he's on YouTube, he's on Twitter. You definitely should go follow him, uh, cool guy. But you know, I think you can learn a lot if you are in SaaS from watching the moves uh, of uh, SaaS people like Daniel Fazio. Uh, and there's a lot of other tips as well that um, we can break down. Uh, and, um, you know, I have videos coming out on kind of like SaaS tips and things like that, that you can copy if you want to do a side hustle uh, uh, that's product based. Uh, now, as always, to get more clients for your, you know, uh, e-commerce or your SaaS, or your info products, you can grab some of my free resources. The link will be in the description.